Hey, so, um, it's time for a Q&A, if you have some questions for me. That's some paper. You can just take one of these. And... Just write, write down your question and return it to me. I'm going to do another video. So, anyways, I was wondering, I don't really know what this video is about because I don't really care, but I guess there's a, a banana man. It, what, so was he, was he saying bananas came out of trees? That's fucking ridiculous. And uh, also, did you... I've got um, I, I, I'm 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 in bed here. I'm sick. I I have food poisoning. I I smeared uh, some monkfish all over the walls of your house. I hope you didn't mind. Um, you. And answer some of your questions. Please be nice. Um, the topics are limited to body modification, uh, surgery, being gay, uh, grow hair long, shoving objects in your anus, grow um, hair longest, getting your, this, grow this hair into your eyes, the so cross section mm -hmm. of your body taken out from the top fly of the bottom, eggs in your eyes, pouring grow different out liquids down you. it, um, flying just whatever you have a question eyes, about, you know, anus, I'm going to answer questions, so. laying eggs in your okay, eyes. here's the first question, so, you, if, if what do you think would be the most useful body modification for you to get um, uh, once there are more expensive and extensive forms available? Signed, Jenny, YouTube Heaven, WCOM. Thanks, Jenny. This, um, is going to be a pretty simple answer. Um, for me, the most useful thing would be to just get a, a whole cross section, cylindrical cross section of my body just taken out. I don't know if I should call it a cross section, but like a cross sample, just a cylindrical, cylindrical chunk of my body going all the way down. M remove it, and you know, I could put jelly beans in there, and people could try to count how many jelly beans, and if they get, you know, closest to the right number they win, like, you know, an elephant or something, or I could put fluids in it, I could do tricks like that, I would, I think that would be pretty cool, um, but I, I think I would also, um, love to just, you know, have a horrible melting face, uh, and have my nose removed, I keep thinking about that, I keep thinking about that, I've been thinking about that, getting my nose removed, just this pasty white, doughy face with this red gash emptiness right in the middle of it and just like melting and screaming that would be I mean that's that's what's so sexy about the future okay so next question you asked um, dear Abby um, why am I so tall um, I would like very much to be a little bit shorter I thought maybe you could help with this since you also are fairly tall um, should I amputate my legs? And I'm saying, if you want to amputate your legs for the sake of amputating your legs, because to not have the legs is what you want, yes, you should do it. Just wanting to be shorter, uh, perhaps cutting your legs off is going to be too drastic a measure. You should be careful that the focus here, whenever you're doing a body modification, is the thing itself. You're doing the thing itself because you want it. There doesn't have to be any other reason because I wanted it. When I started on hormones, it wasn't because I wanted my body to start looking a particular way. I just wanted to be on hormones. And for you, you should chop your legs off, but not to make yourself shorter. You should chop your legs off if you really just don't feel right with legs, okay? Um, and so I've got a message here um, from Peter, Peter Korf. Um, it says, you talk a lot, 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 talk a lot. That's about it. I like, um, 
I don't know. I like queers. So that's it. That's my response. Please post more questions. I'll respond to them.